did and then you divide it again and then... Woo! Look Ooh. at that! Benny Rodriguez says yawn! This is the most interesting story I've covered on the channel in three years! Hi, Anderson! Hi, Anderson! Well, I guess there's one take. What's going on, Ben? What's going on today? Well, I guess you could say we're uh, getting bigger. Ooh. We're getting bigger. Yeah, I think we're getting bigger. I, I don't know what the right word is. I just wanted to do a chip trick so you guys can see. I'm basically a magician. Uh, I built a whole empire and I started with nothing, right? Isn't that so? You just start with one and then you divide it and then you divide it again and then. Woo! Look Ooh, at that! Baby. Look at that! That's my chip tricks. <laughs> Uh, real excited. Uh, we got some cool stuff. We got kind of a surprise coming tomorrow. We're uh, real thrilled about Bitcoin is up. We had our meeting, our meetup in Nashville. I'm always, and this is hard. It's hard to humble me. I'm always humbled by how many people show up to these meetups. Like it's amazing. It doesn't matter where we have it. We always have about three to 400 people. And you know, like I had one guy that showed me his portfolio. It's over a million dollars. He said, that's all thanks to, you know, what he's learned on my channel. And I know people that got in later, like they may not be doing that great, but if you've been listening to what we've been talking about on this channel for years now, you're crushing it. And so, you know, it's very excited to see that. Um, there was one kid that was pretty cool. He was dressed in like a suit. He had these sunglasses on. He was probably like, I don't know, eight, nine, ten. He's about the age of my son. And, uh, you know, his dad was telling me that he had asked for only crypto for Christmas last year. And uh, so, sure enough, his dad gave him crypto for Christmas. It's 10 x since he gave it to him. So uh, pretty cool just to see all the people get involved in crypto and meeting everybody. We, we had a blast, it was fun. Sounds good, we'll do that. Awesome. Heather is all I got. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna go look at some uh, new cars. Boom. Who was that, TJ? That was the Monday sales meeting with uh, Jay Chains, Heather and Joe, just going over uh, sales and sponsors for BitBoy Crypto and a little bit of planning on how we're going to do it for uh, some of the other brands as well. So gotcha. another meeting in the books. Oh. Right. NFT department. Uh, well, featuring Ben. Oh, hey. <laughs> I'm everywhere. What oh, is hey. going on? Uh, what is today? Monday. Mon Mon today's Monday. So I guess it's time for the uh, Iran fact of the week. Right. So I think so. Uh, something that most people don't know about Iran that is that he has an uh, earthworm farm and that he is the largest supplier of bait and tackle earthworms in the North Atlanta area. <laughs> so y'all go check that out. Support him, go buy a bucket of worms from him. Yes, but Iran is an earthworm farmer. All right. We'll have to go talk to him about yeah. that. Yeah, go check it out. He'll, he'll, man, he knows everything there is to know about earthworms. <laughs> Man, these, these Elrond facts, you really have to dig deep for those ones. Oh! Oh! Hey. Love it. <laughs> Mr. DZ underscore, we'll go with MTG today. Yeah, MTG, uh, the floating face that plays Magic. But no longer, <laughs> I haven't played Magic in months. Sorry, Magic fans. Um, uh, what do we got? Are you not hosting around the blockchain today, are you? No, it's uh, TJ. So nice. it's TJ is hosting. So that'd be a pretty good one. Um, nice. I'm what doing the booking right now, kind of catching up. But tell you why it's going to be good. We got face, crypto face. The fans oh, love right. crypto face and uh, Tom Crown. Nice. And uh, I think I, I can see some sparks flying already. All right. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we're, we're about to shoot Wednesday's episode this afternoon. So we're looking oh, at some things, but I don't want to give away any things. You got to watch Wednesday, but we got an Akon, Akon uh, approved drop. So oh. we're platform. So you right. might want to check that out. Welcome to Bitboy Crypto, home of the Bit Squad, the largest and greatest crypto community in all the interwebs. My name is Ben. Every day on this channel, I show you how to make money in crypto. If you like money in crypto, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Today is Monday, September 27th, uh, and it is... It's a decent 73 degrees here in the BitBoy Crypto Studio. Uh, guys, tomorrow's the top of the market. Are you all ready?
last week, ETH prices fell due to a flurry of issues arising from China. A rebound move ensued later this week, but another sell-off on Friday after the People's Bank of China reiterated that crypto transactions are illegal. Uh, you guys know what else is illegal in China? Facebook. You know what else is illegal in China? Google. You know what else is illegal in China? Amazon. Apple. All of these are illegal in China. Okay, just so you guys know. Um, and that has not had an effect on those at all. So. Oh, Benny Rodriguez says yawn. This is the most interesting story I've covered on the channel in three years. If you tired, be quiet and go to sleep, ho. That's all I got to say to you, Benny. You're a dis you're a disgrace to my name. Better not be yawning over this hamster story. This is so interesting. Well, I guess there's one takeaway. People hate hamsters. And obviously, as my hamster demonstrated, hamsters also hate people. So I guess we have to really figure out what to do there. All right, guys, that's all we got. Uh, great show today. Congratulations to the Falcons for a win. Uh, don't win too many games. That way I can buy you. Uh, that's all I got. Be blessed. Good boy. I think they're different sizes. It actually looks uh, screen printed. Where did we get these from? Uh, those are screen printed. They are? They should be. Yes. So we got Frank. I like the new one though. The, the new merch from the meetup was called like Digital Transfer or something. It's a new one. Kind of like it. New Money Game. Oh, hey, look at that. Let's go. That's nice. It'll match Justin's new Money Game colored shoes. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, hey, he's getting that tattoo, isn't he? I know. He's, get, he's getting this little square box right here, right on the back of his calf, I think. Nice. So. When's that going down? Soon. All right. Check it out. Lame. Lame, lame, lame. None of these are cool. And then you look at mine. You'd spend 10 ETH on that, right? Oh, yeah. no. What? That's because you're poor. I mean, I paid 3 ETH for something that's not even an NFT. It's just a picture okay. of a tweet. I paid 3 ETH for a screenshot of a tweet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, hey, you guys were at uh, Best Buy before? Oh, yeah. Let me show you what we got. So this week, what we're going to do is we're doing... Cheap versus expensive, and see which one's better. See if the expensive product is worth the expense or not. We're doing smart light bulbs. Ooh, okay. So I got these, Jack got these. What brand is the other one? Philips Hue and what's the other yeah, one? Yeah, it's by GE, and then these okay. are Philips Hue. All right. And uh, these were $18.99, and these were 80. So these are four times as much. All right. And I don't think they're gonna be four times as good, so we're gonna see. All right. We will, will let you know, but I I think you're gonna end up wanting these. Nice. I will take toys. When is it going up? Uh, it's going up Sunday at noon or three. And I'm gonna try and find a cheaper alternative to those too, because they're really cool. But guess how much those are, Frank? Uh, 100 bucks. Keep going. 150. 180. 180. Whoa. For seven little lights you stick on your wall. Come I think on. that's ridiculous. But they are expandable, so you can always buy more. The extension packs are cheap. They're like 30 bucks. Gotcha. You don't know. You want to know what else is expandable? Your knowledge if you tune in. You're not even recording. Damn. No, you're not. Yes. Oh. Now you are. <laughs> We lose your NFT. High energy, high energy. We want high energy. We're not prepared today at all. <laughs> yeah, that's what it basically is. It's been, we've been just. We we had a huge. We had fights. We can't had put a this. fight right when we came. Right when I came in, Daisy accused me of stealing a sandwich. So, uh, are we talking about anything good today? NFTs. All right. The NFT update. Thank you, dude. Very well. Brian Emery, guys. At your service, Justin. Yes, okay. Thank you. <laughs> All right. You want you wanted a sneak peek at a low market cap gym here? Actually, I don't know their market cap. It could be medium, Good. but it's not big. Oh, them. Net Burke. Net V R K. Not work. Burke. All right. Yeah. So there's a game that we're talking about: street fighting with Ethereum. Imagine Street Fighter betting with Ethereum. But it's a bar fight, and you're fighting with some crazy NFTs. But it, it looks like Street Fighter. We're gonna show it. 
Yeah. All right. So They're going to have a virtual bar on NetVRK. Nice. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna briefly mention it. They're not sponsoring the video or anything. We're just briefly mentioning it, but you we're know, gonna have a bar. Net, net VRK. Okay. Uh, I mean, so the a, metaverse a is gonna be yeah. a. Maybe I'll relapse yep. digitally. In blockchain. <laughs> I have a, a blockchain relapse. <laughs> oh my God. Brian Garcia. Wait, what? I just want to delete your footage, man. <laughs> What's going on? How's your day going? You're gonna delete this, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> Weird. Franklin put me in the hit yesterday. Brandon, what's going on, dude? Hey, what's going on, my man? Nothing much. What do you got going on today? I'm working on this week's edition of Bearish or Bullish. Nice. Uh, we just got the footage a little bit ago. Haven't looked at it yet, but I've heard it's very good. Uh, but right now I'm just kind of pre-planning, grabbing some graphics off of the internet, just trying to make my job a lot easier once I actually get in and start doing the cutting. Any, uh, did you see the burrito clips in the last episode? Hey, how's it going, Frank? It's going, ooh, baby, look at that burrito. That thing's a beefy one. Yeah, you like that? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should have used a different inflection on that. It was funny. We couldn't land on a not inappropriate way to talk about your burrito. There's no way to talk about a burrito without it being a little bit inappropriate, so... <laughs> it comes with the territory. It's just the cross you have to bear. <laughs> uh, nothing super exciting. We have new news. I think it's funny, after the whole Cardano thing, the only thing they're talking about is the Dish Network and Boost Mobile. <laughs> when there was a lot of other cool stuff. Tune in to uh, BJ After Dark for that one. <laughs> oh god, Aaron's like, oh! But for the most part, most of the show's working the same. I set up for Ben's iPad this morning, which was funny because I didn't know they were going to run it. But I think my favorite two comments when I popped on screen was one, do I shop at Baby Gap for my shirts? <laughs> the answer is yes. <laughs> and then obviously my height. I made some sweet music over the weekend, which oh, I might yeah. eventually show you guys. But I'm trying to sell that to some other people. So maybe right. we won't show it to you. I don't know. 1,000 likes and I'll think about it. Right. But you want to see something seductive? What do you think of Brian's feet? <laughs> Easy getting a break today, huh? Uh, Every Monday? Yeah, comfortable break. We got TJ, he's going to knock it out of the park, and uh, it's a so good day to have Crypto yeah, Face on. So. Yes. I'm, so good one. I'm looking forward to it. Welcome to BitBoy Crypto, home of the BitSquad, the largest and greatest crypto community in all the interwebs. My name is TJ and I'll be your host for today's episode of Around the Blockchain. We've got some really good guests and some really good topics lined up for you today. We're going to be getting into the Reddit effect on crypto. Today, guys and as always we'll be back tomorrow 5 p.m. Eastern time we got we're just short of 3,500 likes so if you could just smash that like button on the way out we'd really appreciate it but that's all we have time for today we'll see you tomorrow TJ out so TJ yes how did that uh, episode around blockchain go uh, it went really well you know we had mine your biz who won he crushed it a mining uh, content channel so he was really awesome we actually had people asking for more mining content this morning so it was great we gave it to him tonight Wendy O always brings the heat, so does Crypto Face, so they all have a really, really good perspective on the markets and good stuff to say. We talked about the Reddit thing that's happening with uh, you know, the Wall Street Bets guys getting into Reddit. We talked about Ethereum, it just recently hit a dump, but all this Ethereum's getting removed from exchanges. What does that mean? Some people think that's bullish, some people think it on-chain and metrics don't really matter that much. So that was a good discussion. And the big one, the Cardano Summit over the weekend, we broke down kind of the, the biggest announcements from that, what people thought about it. So all in all, it was a really good day. We've got the Ocean guys just got here tonight. It's actually Tyler Ocean's birthday today. So we're gonna go celebrate him, get ready to launch hit music. So stay tuned, big things in the works for that. So that's cool.